Well, every month, KOCO honors one teacher who has gone the extra mile to serve Metro students and their families. And we do that through our Teacher of the Month series. It's an effort to celebrate our teachers, let them know that we appreciate them. Absolutely. And today, we are excited to honor our next amazing teacher here in the Metro. The excitement's killing us. KOCO's Chase Rutledge is standing by right now. Chase, you're at Taft Middle School. We can reveal that. And we're about to surprise our October Teacher of the Month. Take it away. Yeah, we can finally tell you we're here at Taft Middle School for 7th and 8th grade special education teacher, Ms. Jackson. She's right behind this door. We're going to go surprise her right now. Ms. Jackson? Hi! Hi! How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. My name is Chase <laughs> Rutledge. I'm with KOCO Channel 5. You are our October Teacher of the Month. Oh my gosh. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank How you are you? So much. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? <laughs> All right, so we want to talk to you a little bit about your, your work here at, uh, at Taft Middle School. Tell us, uh, tell us about your job. Okay, well, I am a special education teacher at Taft Middle School. I was placed here during my student teaching, and that was 12 years ago. It is an awesome place to be. I could not love it more. Okay, and I'm sure your kids love you just as much. <laughs> uh, tell us a little bit about the work. You have a store that you've kind of developed and they run. Tell us about that. I do. It's called the Royal Cafe because we are the Taft Royals. Um, and so we have a Google form that the teachers can fill out, and we have it up on our board live. And when an order comes in, our kids get up and prepare the order and take it out for delivery. So it's teaching the kids money skills, um, life skills, job skills, communication, navigating around the building and things like that. And it generates a little money for us to do fun things like field trips. Yeah, so Ms. So. Jackson, so we hear that uh, you rarely take a break. Like you have <laughs> planning periods that you don't use, you have lunches that you don't, you don't take just because you're here for your kids. Now you also deal with um, some sound and anxiety with your kids because yes. they're special needs. Talk yes. to us about that, how, how you handle that. Yeah, so, um, you know, loud noises like screaming in the hallway, the whistling and things like that. Even our loud, our air conditioner is kind of blowing loud. Um, and it's just that constant noise that kind of, you know, you don't realize how loud it is until it's turned off. Mm -hmm. um, so we just always are kind of looking out for ways that we can help buffer that and, and um, make every experience for my kids enjoyable so yeah. they don't have to worry about things like that. Oh, I know, it's just, and it's a special community. So special education teachers, I mean, they hold a dear place in my heart. My mom was an educator. Oh. My sister's a special education oh, teacher. Awesome. But um, I, I know that it's a challenge sometimes. Talk to us about the challenges that some of your students face here at the school. Um, my kids really, they impress me every day. Um, they look at a challenge and sometimes we'll, we'll work together to figure out how to overcome that challenge. Um, but it's, it, we really get a chance to be creative. And so I think a lot of the things that time is not always on our side. I wish I had more time to do other things with my kids. Um, but we make the best use of our time and what we have during the day. So. so I also know that that creativity comes at a cost sometimes. You talk mm -hmm. about financial experience and things like that for your kids. Mm -hmm. We want to help you out with that. So we have uh, Erin, where, where's Erin? There she is with Quail Creek Bank. <laughs> she has a check for you for $1,000 wow. that you can use towards your classroom and towards your kids through donor shoes. How, how might you be able to use this money? Here, take, here you could hold on to this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is your check. Oh, wow. I have a long list of things that I would love to purchase with this, but because of, you know, financial constraints that um, I sometimes have to ask, you know, family members with the Amazon wish list and things like that, but this will be great. I was just talking yesterday that we need more noise canceling headphones, so that'll be the first thing that I purchase. Well, this will be great. This should go a long way towards those. I know those can be expensive, yes. and I know um, you know your community helps out quite a bit. We appreciate you so much, and I know Aaron does too. Aaron, do you want to get back in here? No, you don't. Okay, that's <laughs> fine. <laughs> the check's the most important thing, so that's good. But we Thank appreciate you. you, and we appreciate the work you do here. I know the staff does too, and your kids, of course. I'm sure they love you. You guys love Miss Jackson. That's awesome. <laughs> so. Thank you so much. Thank we you. appreciate all the hard work that you do. And there are so many other teachers out there that work just as hard as Ms. Jackson. We want to get those nominations out there. You can go to the KOCO website. You can go to the mobile app and nominate the next teacher of the month. Hopefully it'll be one of you out there.